to the channel or welcome if it is you are new i am your girl chanel the living dolly thank you so much for clicking on this video and thank you so much for coming to chill with your girl if you have never seen my face before on your screen i am chanel i do all things beauty fashion travel and lifestyle and i would love if you had subscribed to my channel please thank you <laughs> if you are retaining what's up babe how you doing what's up how you doing what's up I am here to just chill with you all for a little bit, to show you all a little bit of my weekend. It was a pretty chill weekend, like most of my weekends, you know, I don't really do much. I'm very much a homebody. Who knows, I might break out of that little box this year. Um, the only time I'm not a really much a homebody is when it is I'm traveling, but yeah. For the most part, I'm a homebody. But anyway, I hope you enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't love, don't forget, sorry, <laughs> to tell me which part of the video was your favorite. So let me know what you did this weekend. Did you do anything fun? I would love to know. All right. And if you're interested in this hair, and you all will shortly see this dress and this makeup look, I did everything for you all in this video. So high five. We outside. <laughs> all right, cool. <laughs> Bye. Good morning guys happy saturday so currently i believe it's like after six half six or somewhere after six um i've been up since five i had a really busy day yesterday a lot of running around so i fell asleep like around half past nine last night which is superbly early for me normally i would fall asleep like around midnight even if i'm in my bed I don't sleep until midnight which is i don't know i really wish that could change because it will really help me a lot anyway i'm gonna work on that but yeah because of that now i'm up super early nobody else is up as you can tell the place is still dark I'm now trying to get a little bit of light because it's like after six but now i made us some hot dogs for dinner last night so i'm gonna have that for breakfast and just chill for the hour I may have a couple deliveries for my thrift store to do. Um, I'm going to see if I have any more items that I can post up to sell. What else? What else do I have planned today? I am in 10,000 minds. <laughs> if it is, I want to do a Shein haul because y'all, I kid you not, a try on haul is extremely exhausting especially when it is super hot it I, I just oh i don't know if anybody's like me comment down below if you are but when i feel super hot i get angry that's weird right i get irritated because i'm just like it is so hot i'm literally like beads of sweat even if you don't see it on my face it's on my body and that irks my soul i hate to feel sweaty but anyway so that's why i somebody asked me the other day actually was it just yesterday um dd my darling she asked um chanel why did you stop doing she and holes and that is why because it is so hot and it's a lot to do it's a lot to do so you know i i want to do it so i may do it if not today probably tomorrow please god but i want to put that video up you know so i'll have two videos per week i really want to stick to that two youtube videos per week it is it's not easy because as i've said before i have no idea what to post besides my weekly vlogs because those actually do the best um when i say weekly vlogs like active vlogs when i'm actually going somewhere doing things i mean although i have been noticing though that my boring vlogs do really good too <laughs> y'all are weird <laughs> because sometimes i legit don't be doing nothing special and people are enjoying it but i mean that just goes to show that you know different people enjoy different things what may seem boring or just mm, for me many people think yay you know that that is where they um relate to the most so i don't know we'll see how it goes but yeah we do have to um organize today Plus today is lessons for Naya. She has some 
long hours today because it's getting really close to Spanish orals. For those of you who, I, I don't think I didn't mention anything. So I don't know if you all remember, was it like two or three weekly vlogs ago? It was right after we came back from Guatemala. Naya did her photo nutrition practical and we got back her results for her SB and she got 92%. Hello, Deborah. <laughs> 92% so yes so we're, we're starting it off good so the next one we have is on April 24th which is her Spanish oral so she has Spanish from 9 to 1 today and then maths after from 2 to 5 yeah that's what it is CXC let's say what check in with you all in a bit so these hot dogs Naya made for us was so good. I'm helping her make some caramelized onions. Okay, guys. So we have a package here it's on the flip side because I don't want my dress showing. But yeah, we got a new package from Lovely Wholesale. I am super excited. I chose out three. Well, they allowed me to choose out three of their outfits. I love working with Lovely Wholesale. They have some really, really, really nice pieces. One of them I'm supposed to be wearing to church tomorrow. So, yes. I'm going to show you all that probably tomorrow, please God. In the meantime, I am packing out some orders for my thrift store. Um, I'm having a little sale right now. By the time you all have seen this, the sale will be over because it's only a weekend sale. But yeah, um, that's basically what I've been doing, organizing orders and doing some research on some stuff as well. But yes, that's the vibe. So this is what they're looking like. She also grilled the buns and added some pepper jack cheese. Okay, guys, so it is now Sunday and I'm going to be starting or including something that I have been thinking about for a while. Um, I want to do some more makeup tutorials and show people how to create like really pretty looks and stuff like that. So yes, welcome to a tutorial within a vlog. So what I'm going to do is put on my light so you can properly see what I'm doing. But I already have on my base and I am just blending it in. These these kind of videos are mainly going to be for like my makeup lovers. But I want to make sure that it's within an actual vlog because I was getting ready for church. So this entire look is going to be based around one of the outfits um, that was sent to me by Wholesale 21. Sorry, I made a mistake early by, earlier by saying Lovely Wholesale because Lovely Wholesale has also sent me some pieces as well in the past and they've also been really good. So uh, now back to the look. So what I'm doing right now is basically setting my eyeshadow primer. This is just concealer that I'm using. Sorry, I'm closing my door. But yeah, this is just concealer that I'm using and I'm just setting it with my Sasha Buttercup powder. I also set a little bit of powder on my eyebrows. So this look is going to be a kind of teal green kind of look. I really love to create eyeshadow looks that just have a seamless blend to them. So one thing that I notice goes really well with almost every look in outfit wise and makeup is a sunset inspired or like a sunset background so what i did first was i used a very mild orange and then i used a deeper orange so as you all can tell it does give us the sunset vibe and to deepen up the outer third of our crease i used a deep green so i had to pull out the dress because i had to figure out <laughs> which color green it was i was using my juvia's place wahala 2 palette and i could not figure out which one to use because they have two really pretty teal greens there but I just had to properly examine it and hope that I used the right color. But honestly, it really came out very pretty. And that color looks absolutely stunning. Juvia's Place for the win. Love, love, love. So this is the palette that I'm using, right? That is the Wahala 2. Very pigmented and a lot of colors. So yeah, mainly blue. Blue base though. But say what? So now I am just using that seam concealer the LA Girl pro concealer and i lay that down as a base so that my glitter shadow hair will stick to that so you all don't have to run out and go get some expensive concealer just use the LA Girl pro concealer 32 dollars at pennywise so to create a look that has a deepening effect i'm just spreading that green that i have in the outer third into my crease the crease is the area in the middle of your eye socket right there now i'm into doing my face I like to prefer to, sorry, I like to do my makeup. This is just my personal preference where I do my base and then I switch on to my eyes. 
that's just me but i know a lot of people prefer to do their eyes first or and then after their base but i find i like when the concealer has some time to kind of dry a little bit so that it gives me more of a fuller coverage this is a tip that i always tell people when i discovered this invest in some powder puffs those things literally are the best things of life they really give you a gorgeous set and it just gives you a very seamless finish powder puffs are very flat and are easy to just blend your powder into your face so i'm baking a little bit because i want to make sure that it's everything is going to be set and neat because i'm an oily girl and now i'm just outlining my lips with a brown lip liner and throwing on some fenty lip gloss so i have not done this in a while just give myself like a good contour i'm a powder contour kind of girl i just prefer it that way i like to powder my cheeks my chin and my nose bridge now i'm adding some blush this blush is from juvia's place and also i'm adding some highlighter that i'm blending into the blush it's just going to give it a very soft pretty finish not too much and then i like to put a little bit on my nose and on my brow bone so that's what the look is so this is the entire look with the dress from wholesale 21 my coupon code is dolly8 and i really did love how the look turned out so yes and this is the makeup look i am in the car we are about to leave to head to church and i'm very much pleased i did all of this in 15 20 minutes okay guys so i am back from church it is so hot like today is really really hot but the makeup is holding up really well so that's good but yeah it was a really lovely day at church a really lovely morning and i'm actually going out later i know right you know just for a little food a little small lime i'm up for it but yeah the dress really was a hit i'm very pleased lovely wholesale i am just waiting to find out if i have a coupon code and i will definitely post it of course you know the whole uh, well, i'm not sure if i told you all but i did a get ready with me this morning so i showed you all the whole process of me not makeup well i showed you makeup on youtube but i wasn't feeling to do all of that for every single platform but anyway so i am going to um edit that and as soon as they tell me if i have a code more than likely i will but hopefully they answer me in time because i want to post it tonight um yeah i'll put it up so you all can get this dress i'm really pleased with the quality it is not cheap at all very light so even though i'm feeling sweaty i'm not dying of sweat <laughs> dying of heat but yeah it really did look good and yes i definitely pick the right color for my eyes i was kind of confused at first because i wanted the whole effect of pulling it right out of the bag and everything i don't know how it is but yeah but it's hot like i just want some water right now and possibly to take a shower even though i just took a shower like three hours ago but anyway so i'll check back with you all in a bit okay so it's time to deconstruct this look i'm thinking about taking off this hair because like it's i feel like it's too nice to just be wearing like regular regular everyday boring and honestly when i go to work with it well i've only worn it to work this past week it was just in a claw clip i think one day or two days i ended up wearing it out but the ac was just literally just sucking out all the moisture so it was just looking poofy mm. so i may switch it out to go out later and um I have to wash that one i'm so quickly i could do that yeah my favorite wig again you all know i love it <laughs> but yeah i may um put this back on for mother's day oh i have another unit that i have not i received i don't want to lie it right before i went to guatemala mm -hmm. a very cute one that i have not even tried yet so i think i may do a look with that for mother's day i do not know what yet but we'll see how it goes but yeah the color oh mm -hmm. even better than this one yeah but anyway um yeah i may wash my favorite wig and put it on and then i may wash this one today as well but say what time to get out of these shoes i was wearing these gorgeous 
platform heels. Let me see if I can put up my foot so you all can see. One, two, three, go. There we go. These gorgeous platform heels. First time I'm wearing them, superbly comfortable. But yeah, it's time for me to get out of them. <laughs> there we go, back to Flatland. Okay, so Naya is making some flatbread pizza. I think she's using some tortilla wraps. They're very easy to do and she loves to make these, you know, when she's not pleased with whatever food we have in the house. And this is the brand of tortilla wraps that we use. This is what the pizza is looking like. So she makes these for lunch and for dinner. And I am now just taking a quick little just a face care break, some self-care. I actually didn't even bother going out anymore. I just wanted to just relax. Yes, I'm a granny. So she gave me a slice of her pizza, <laughs> even though I was eating some lo mein, and it was really good. <laughs> okay, guys, so do not get upset with me. I literally just didn't feel like doing much, but... I feel bad at the same time because I know there are people who, you know, look forward to certain things on my channel. So what I'm going to do, yes, I'm still wearing my mask in my face. I'm about to take a shower and wash it off and then get ready for bed. Because, you know, these 30 minute weekends that we have. But anyway, what I'm going to do, though, is lay out um, some of the items I got from Shein. I'm not going to show you the clothes because I'll probably do a try on haul with those. But... I did get some accessories that I really think a lot of you would be interested in. So, you know, I'll show you those. So let's get into it. <laughs> okay, so the first item I'm going to show you are the slides I got. Um, I have not even opened them up yet. I honestly was going to do a haul where it is I'm like dressed and like talking about them. But I mean, I still wanted to show you all this stuff. Okay, forgive me because I got nails and it's kind of hard to open these. All right, let me get my tripod. This is too much work. Okay, so I wanted you all to see the exact color of the slides. This is what it's look looking like. Sorry. They are green slides with some kind of like, I don't know. It's kind of like looking like carpet material. But listen, they are so soft and comfortable. And I've been seeing them everywhere. And this is going to be really great, you know, just to chill around the house or even on vacation. I will leave the links to them in the description box down below so you can check it out. They have a lot of colors in this. All right, let me show you the next one. Okay, so next up I have these pair of slides. These are some pink slides. As I said before, all links will be in the description box down below. So I do not know the names, right? But it will be there. So make sure and go check. And yeah, they're very cute. I'm. I mainly bought these slides because I don't have like a lot of flat shoes um, and then like especially on vacation I like to kind of switch it up with like the colors and stuff like that so you know I'm just kind of planning ahead but these are really cute I like these and they have several different colors as well like about 18 19 colors every color you could think of they have it so yeah check them out as well okay so next up I have these baseball caps I really do like the logos on this one this one says thick thighs times thin patience which is very much me but anyway and then I have this green one it's not showing up the exact color for the for the green one on camera but I really like how it says baby girl 90s I like that kind of you know cute kind of aesthetic and I have some cool outfits that I have planned I'm so excited you're like oh I, I wish I could tell you all so many things that yeah but in the meantime yeah this is what it is we're looking at for the hats but yeah, I'm really trying to diversify my closet, you know, my aesthetic. So I thought I wanted to include some headpieces as well. Because I used to wear a lot of hats back in the day, but I don't know what happened. Like, I don't know, I guess I just didn't want it to mess up my wig. But I really want to get back into that, that hat girl era. So yeah. Of course, what would be a Shein haul from Chanel without some handbags, right? You all know I have to have them. As you can tell, just from outside of the packaging. I mean, we have to see it out of it as well. But, oh, baby, beautiful. I mean, just look at that. Look at that. Let's get closer. Oh, my gosh. The color is absolutely stunning. And I'm telling you, it's not doing it justice. Like, I have to show you all of this in the daytime. But... It is like a teal, a very bright teal. 
oh it's really beautiful i love it from the time i saw it i was just like ah uh, yeah you're coming home with me love you and then i also wanted to get like a casual one which is like this one over here okay oh, put my knee tape on. i'm very happy to do it with one hand by the way okay not that bad but yes this is what it looks like this one is um something that i saw with a look Normally when I shop, I like to think about the pieces in correlation with an entire outfit. So I have some outfits that I want to wear these bags with. Like, I love it. I love a good pop of orange. It's just more of a casual vibe. And this is definitely more of a going out dress up. Then I have me some resin jewelry. Listen, this has slowly become some of my favorite pieces that I've been just getting obsessed with. Like, I'm just thinking ahead because I like to plan ahead, you know, outfits and looks that I want to do, would want to try, experiment with. That's just how I am, but yeah. So I got me some of these. These are like resin, as you can tell, 30 packaging. Um, I don't want to take it out just yet because I haven't figured out a place to just store bangles. So I'm going to look on Amazon and see if they have anything like that. I already have something for like rings and earrings. But anyway, so, I have this in brown, so it has like a brown, I don't know what color is this, you all can tell me, and like this kind of cream beige, and then I have some green ones over here. I also have some rings that match these that I got last time, the last couple times, and then I have some of these kind of like chunky purple rings. I just love the kind of metallic or chrome kind of vibe. Oh, I'm obsessed, so yeah. These are the accessories. Do I have any more? Yeah, I think I have like a couple more. Well, I got like regular earrings and stuff, you know. And then I have um, a pair of shades. Yeah. All right, let me show okay, you. Okay, the so these are the shades that I got. It's a uh, clear. As you can tell, it's totally clear there. And then it has like the silver frame around it. Listen, <laughs> the looks I'm going to do with this baby are like, oh my gosh. And if you all do not know, Shein's, um, what is this? Shein's shades usually come in some kind of storage package as well as with this little cloth to clean it off, which I think is really good. So I love that. Did I get this way? Yeah. All right, so that is the end of this. <laughs>